in most marketplaces, the four primary price points of homes that are in any market are entry level, average priced homes, high end homes, and luxury homes. And literally, literally, if just by adding more high end and luxury homes to your sold portfolio, you can increase your average sale price. You can net a lot more income or commissions, even if commissions do go down. So, you know. The, the, Kevin laid out a potential problem, and I'm laying out to you the potential solution. The potential solution, if commissions do go down, is you increase your average sale price, work smarter and not harder. You can actually net more money even if commissions do go down. I will tell you the other benefit of luxury is it's a little bit – I don't want to say it's its own bubble and, and, and luxury is protected – but it is its own animal. I go to these big conferences. I've seen all these people speak. I mean, I had a gentleman say that he thinks 50% of all transactions in five years are going to be iBuyer transactions. If you don't know about iBuyer, it's a totally different animal. But what I can tell you is when I, when I, when I really push these people, Kevin, they don't have the data when it comes to high-end and luxury for iBuyer because it's, it's, yeah. it, 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 it's protected. It's a different little bubble. And I'm not well, saying that's always going to yep. be that way, but for right now, you know, most of the data, most of these iBuyer programs are for entry-level properties or average-price properties, not your high-end and luxury.